Hey guys, it's Chubb. Today I'll be opening a hanger box of Diamond Kings Baseball. Uh, I found this at Barnes & Noble. If you saw my previous video, I made a video saying I found uh, baseball cards, Diamond Kings at Barnes & Noble. Um, I opened one of those, uh, one of the hanger boxes. I still have the second one, but um, I actually had to go there today just to pick something up. And I found some more, so I found two more hanger boxes in this, and today I'll be opening one. But I also got a Topps tin from the comic store that I usually go to, and I opened them already, but I'm just going to go with the highlights of them. Let me just pull them out of this tin. Honestly, uh, this is my first Topps tin. I'll show you the cover of them. Uh, you can get different players on the front. I don't think if it necessary doesn't really matter, I don't think. Uh, I just picked whatever. I was going to pick the Akuna one, but I didn't. But here is the tin, Top Series 1. I thought this was a nice pickup, and yeah, just mad here. But the highlights, um, you get. Oh, I don't know if it all, but I got the Anthony Rizzo uh, one. It's like an old style one. It's really cool. Adele rookie. Uh, great they have a top scrum you get from this. Got this nice Miguel Andrew jar and Os Aruv. Uh, I forgot what these ones are called as well, but got I got the chrome so. With that, and I also here's a stack I got. I have my big top piece in here, uh, but I got these three Posey, Buster Posey, and let me see if I can get the other one in this stack. I'm looking for it. And I got uh, Otani, he's he's doing really great in baseball right now. Yeah, I got um, and Otani, so yeah, uh, those are great. Uh, nice pick up there. My first tin I got for this year is either that or a um, or Heritage Blaster or a Bowman Blaster. I decided to take the tin because I'm uh, planning on do getting something else for uh, Bowman uh, this year. Because I didn't want to get a blaster. I was going to do like a retail box or maybe or something like that. And they also, yeah, that was all they had there. And a Bowman hobby, but yeah, let's get into the Simon Kings. So, find three SPs and two inserts per box on average. Find one hanger box exclusive red frame parallel. And my last one, uh, the one I opened was a Chris Bryant uh, parallel. I've only opened one of these hanger boxes, so it's gonna be interesting to see. Just get these scissors. Um, yeah, this is uh, how many people I don't know how people think about this product. I'm like, this product would be much better in my opinion if they were lifers but since they're not uh, they still they still can hold some value but still much better with the two logos if they were um with the um uh, MLB like I, I I really like tops I still buy tops I, I just wish they both had license like stuff that they don't because you know upper deck has NHL uh can't really buy that and Don, um, Nini has basketball. They do soccer, uh, but I don't think they do might. And they have um, NFL. And then Tops has WWE. They have Garbage Patch Kids, but for sports, uh, they have um, uh, soccer. Yeah, soccer. But yeah, let's go get into this. Got a Keegan Aiken rookie. Philadelphia Spencer Howard, George Sisson, Roberto Clemente, and a young, and I see our parallel. Let me just move these to the back. My back. Oh, is that a. I think I got an Adele from that last time. Andy uh, Young, rookie. There you go, Chris Bryant. Jami Jones, rookie. Joe Crown, rookie. I'm not rookie. I don't know why I said that. Louis Patton. Lou Gedrick, Bo Bidget, uh Bob Gibson. We have uh, debut Diamond Kings Ryan Mount Mountcastle, Evy Garcia uh, rookie, Nick Nadert. I think that's how you say. It. Getting into the back row, we have Shane McLean, Diamond Kings uh, debuts, Javier Reyes. Uh, oh, so oh, two, and our bread parallel is Joe Joe Adele. So this is a rookie. Um, uh, I'm just looking. 
since he was drafted in the 10th overall in 2017. But his rookie cards. Yeah. So yeah, that's awesome. Red parallel of him. I have a lot of him this year, actually. Ripped a lot of him. Artist proof. That's Drain of Flor Floral. Um, what is that saying the back? Uh, but uh, OJ remix. And we have Fra Francisco Lindor, Calvary of Stars. So honestly, that was pretty good. Uh, Red Parallel was very nice. Actually, it was Diamond King's card like this. Uh, I like the without the red. But yeah, honestly, that was a fun rip. I uh, definitely recommend Hunter Mark and Noble Pines. Just some cards. I'm like, $10 for this box. Like, can't go wrong with that. And honestly, it depends on how much you have of Series 1. I definitely get Series 1 first um, before I pick up a hanger box. But I already have a lot of that, so i probably go Diamond Kings. And if you want to go check out more of me opening Diamond Kings, I made a uh, video on opening a hobby box of it. And uh, we had a great auto and pack. So if you want to go check that out, um, yeah, bye.